Hi, thanks for joining us today on Envision. We are here with Dr. Brian Maher, our superintendent, talking about Jefferson High School. It's becoming more and more of a reality every time we say that word out loud. Still plans on paper, uh, but starting to see some action in the Northwest corner of Sioux Falls for Jefferson High School. Where are we at with that? Um, a lot further than we were a month ago and not nearly <laughs> as far as we will be from a month from now. Things are happening so fast right now. Um, we've seen ideas put on paper and we've seen that those ideas iterated over time where we're just about have the final design um, ready and complete. So it's kind of fun now to look to see what this is going to look like. And, uh, and now we're getting ready to do an official groundbreaking yeah. to, to really kick it off. Yeah, that's that's the official point. Even though we'll have some work um, out there being done, the official groundbreaking, certainly we'd invite the community to that if they'd like to attend. Absolutely, we'd love to have community members out there. It's June 18th, 1130, really quickly here. Uh, depending upon when you're watching right. this, maybe it's already <laughs> passed. Uh, but we've actually had work being done out there really since the, the end of May, the first of June, um, Jeff Kreider and the folks in operational services couldn't wait because we <laughs> we are up against a time frame to be able to be in there in the fall of 2021. It, it doesn't seem like it because it seems so far out, but there are so many pieces that need to fall into place. And and as of today, we're still on time. Mm -hmm. We're also on budget. Yeah, those are two really good things. <laughs> Yes, uh, definitely those those things are important to our community. As we said, um, we promised them through our $190 million bond election that, that uh, we needed more space and that we could do that in an efficient and effective manner to, to get kids in that building. Right. We're, we're, in, we're in a really good spot right now, Deanna. I can't emphasize enough how Jeff Kreider, the, just the incredible performance he's had since we passed this mm -hmm. bond issue on September 18th. The work that he's gotten done with our architects and, and with so many other groups that are involved. But Jeff is the person that's, uh, he's the straw that's stirring that drink and thus far he's done just a, a marvelous job. Yeah, wonderful. And and uh, I know when you talk about new buildings, everybody talks about boundaries and I know we've discussed this before, but for those who are wondering, there, there are no decisions at this point in time. It will be a very public process. Um, remind people about that, because that's always a, something that they're interested about. Yeah, but again, that used to be quite a ways away too, but it's creeping <laughs> up on us as well. In the, once we turn the calendar into the year 2020, we'll begin that process. And as you mentioned, it'll be a very public process, much like the strategic plan was, much like the uh, the, the bond. bond, the bond implementation, or the, or the, or the just the preparation for the bond, uh, was we'll we'll really employ people from the community in that process and and try to get to uh, an end result that makes sense in the summer of 2020. So about a year from now, mm -hmm. we'll have that uh, those bond those boundaries set, and it'll be about a year uh, prior to the actual implementation taking place. So a year from now. And a year from and a year from then, then. <laughs> let's not forget we have Ben Rifle Middle School also, and that is in various uh, stages of planning as well. Just maybe, uh, well, we're doing the groundbreaking for that in July. Mm -hmm. So if we're doing Jefferson in June, uh, you know, all of those things are happening, and uh, we'll see some work this summer as well over mm -hmm. on that side of town. You're exactly right. The the same thresholds really hit for Ben Rifle Middle School. Um, we've got a little more time there, a little less stress, only because the building is 100,000 square feet less mm -hmm. than Jefferson High School. So it's a, it's a little bit smaller building, but it's still an incredibly complicated building to put together. So um, we're, we're excited about where we are there. The mm -hmm. drawings are about a month behind <laughs> Jefferson High School. Sure. The, uh, and as you mentioned, the groundbreaking will be about a month behind Jefferson High School. But again, the plan is to be in there by um, August of 2021. And the boundary conversation for the middle schools will mirror the boundary conversation for the high schools. Sure, very good. Well, a lot going on here in the Sioux Falls School District over the summer. We hope you're enjoying a break, uh, but folks down here are really pushing forward. We will see everybody back here in the fall. 
Uh, in the meantime, we'll be working on these projects and others throughout the district. Thanks for joining us today on Envision.